Um, I think I see some friends over there. I don't know. Maybe. What else is happening? I told you about the butterflies, but in case you forgot, on uh, June 26th at Rusk Ranch on the 199 across from the Big Cat Park is uh, the Nature Pavilion with the Monarch Butterflies. And they're going to open at 10 o'clock in the morning and close at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. It's their biggest fundraiser. They also need docents. And pretty much you get to wrangle butterflies. It's not too hard of a job. And they're going to charge $3 to get in. It usually costs 6 So go on down and see uh, all the monarchs. And they've got checkered ladies. And they do the whole thing from the chrysalis to the caterpillars. They also help you grow with your milkweed. So if anybody like you and me are on native soil, uh, you want to be growing your milkweed so the monarchs have a place to land. It's kind of important. They kind of know where they're going and they come back. It's kind of cool because I went down there and there were these milkweeds and then the next day there weren't any and the caterpillars were just wigging out, literally. It's like I've never seen anything like it in my life. I've seen them like in some places out in Tacoma up off of um, Hope Mountain and um, it's pretty amazing. So I'm really grateful that Patty has asked me to go be a docent for the day at um, Rusk Ranch. And I recommend it highly for anybody who has nothing to do next Sunday. <laughs> go check it out. It's a lot of fun. And um, what else can we talk about? Hi, Paul. Paul's not paying attention. He didn't even hear me. <laughs> I was going to thank him. I thank the uh, volunteer kitchen over there for serving meals to a lot of people. You may not know that, but there's a guy way back there in a tent. And for all of us who are volunteers and uh, didn't bring any food or any money, um, he's actually feeding us. And um, a lot of things have changed here. We have a shower now, which is kind of cool. And we're not quite as, um, you know, as spread out. I hope you're all getting to wander around the whole fair and get into the cheap seats way back there. I don't even know where Boone is. He told me he has a booth somewhere. Yeah, and so Tara's back there someplace. You seen him? Yeah. Zuzu has seen Boone, so I might be able to find him. <laughs> well, that's good news. Um, I haven't had a chance to go get a drink of water in a couple minutes, so I'm going to leave you and maybe let Spaceman say something. <laughs> Yeah, I just want to let you know, don't forget to buy your raffle tickets at the Dome School. And also the skate park, they have a, the people doing the skate park in town, they have a booth. And they're raffling off an awesome skateboard. So now's your chance to get a, a brand new skateboard on the raffle. And help out the youth empowerment uh, group. That's uh, putting this whole thing on, actually. And that's a, a non-profit organization.